at Live Radar and 9 day forecast. So you'll know first, this is First Alert Weather. Okay, we really enjoyed the sunshine today. It was so gloomy all weekend, but we still need rain. Oh, we do, you know, it kind of felt kind of damp over the weekend. It was mm -hmm. just so cloudy. We had some showers here and there, but that rain really didn't add up to be very much. And as far as our last like real soaker that we had for the area, you have to go back to August 13th, so more than two months ago. That's the last day that we officially in Kansas City had more than an inch of rain. So since the very next day after that, so the 14th of August, we've only picked up, you see it here, just a little under an inch and a half of rain. That's almost a seven inch deficit, and that's why the drought, is, the drought has really worsened for much of the area. And as far as looking ahead, any additional rainfall this week, not much to see here, so we do have a chance of seeing some showers, but it's not going to amount to much. So our dry weather pattern that's going to go through the rest of the week here, but hopefully next week we'll see some opportunities for rain. I'll mention that on the nine day right now. Sunshine. Nice to have that back. We're currently at 64 degrees. Our air is dry. Humidity at 45%. We're still seeing some of those northerly wind gusts right around 20 miles an hour. 64 in Liberty, 67 degrees in Leavenworth, Lee Summit at 65, 70 degrees in Ottawa. Evening plans, I just recommend taking a jacket if you are going to be heading out, maybe going out to dinner. It's going to be turning cooler, upper 50s by 7 after sunset there, 50 degrees by 9 o'clock. I mentioned about 10 minutes ago that some areas of frost will be possible tomorrow morning, especially if you live outside of the metro. But even in the metro, we could see some frost. 38 degrees are our forecast low in Kansas City, 36 in Ottawa, about 35 in Lawrence, up towards northern parts of Missouri and Kansas. Uh, you could see some frost as well. From there, though, we'll see a nice warm up with the sunshine, with more of a southwest breeze tomorrow. Our temperatures are going to go from those mid to upper 30s early to 57 by 11 a.m., upper 60s later in the afternoon tomorrow. Really just a great day if you have outdoor plans on your Tuesday. Highs will be upper 60s to around 70 degrees pretty close to where we should be for this time of year. So notably warmer for tomorrow. Lots of sunshine, really a great day, a dry day tomorrow. Then on Wednesday, here comes our next chance of rain. So we're looking at midday Wednesday. Let's look at noon. Then here comes a little area of rain. Not much to get excited about. If we even do see any of these showers should be light, should be short lived. This is a look at two o'clock in the afternoon Wednesday and then notice those showers just settle off to the southeast. There's 5 p.m. So could be a little later than what you're seeing here, but you get the idea. This next rain opportunity Wednesday afternoon to the evening. It looks light, maybe a few hundredths of an inch of rain at best. After that, cooler and drier, windier weather for the second half of the week. Highs will be in the mid to upper 60s on Thursday, low 70s Friday, Saturday and through the weekend. Lows in the 40s, so really some great weather for the Kansas City Marathon Saturday morning for sporting Saturday evening. The Chiefs Sunday afternoon against the Chargers. Low 70s will continue into next week. Rain chances we might have to add them back in next Wednesday.